Hi everyone, I'm just going to show you how I get a super casual braid out style and talk about the Afro Centrics line. So I shampooed using their sulfate free Swiss shampoo. It's got a super soft leather, super moisturising but cleanses really well. So for the style I've split my hair in two thirds and I've given myself a middle parting with the front section. For the back section I split my hair into two. You can actually split your hair into three but I've just done two because it's really a lazy casual style. So I'm spraying my hair with water. I've got this spray bottle from Amazon. I really love it because it gives a fine mist. So I'm just spraying down that first medium sized section and working the water into my strands. To moisturize and set the style, I'm using the Smooth Moisturizing Cream. It's got this really body lotion consistency, really amazing blend of ingredients that actually mimic my shea butter mix. So I kind of knew I was gonna love it. Because it's natural, you have to make sure you give it a shake to make sure everything's mixed together perfectly. And again, I'm just working that in from the ends up. Then to seal everything in, I'm going to aptly use their seal oil, which again is a really nice blend of everything from castor, olive and lemongrass oil. Then I'm simply going to braid that section. I'm not the best braider in the world, but I get it how I like it. So you just take three sections and you are always taking the outer strands over the middle. So I'm going to keep braiding until I get to the end. And what I like to do to encourage a kind of coil at the end is to cocoon them, which is basically like a hanging bantu knot. So of course I do the same with the other section, spraying with water just to make it a bit more malleable. Then I add the moisturizing cream and the seal oil before plaiting the section and cocooning the ends. So for that middle section, I'm going to actually split it into three plaits or braids, just because I think that'll help balance out the back and really make it a lot fuller. So it's the same story really, just spraying with water just to make sure that my hair is super, super moisturized and can take in the really nice ingredients that are included in the smooth moisturizer. And then I plait the sections, taking right over middle, left over middle, right over middle, left over middle. So for the front section, I've done three plaits and I'm just going to mimic that on the other side. So the Afrocentrics line has 98% natural ingredients. It doesn't have any nasty stuff like sulfates, mineral oil, parabens, and it's oil enriched, which means that it's perfect for curly, but even especially perfect for coily to kinky hair. It has really great packaging. I found it really easy to use and the bottles weren't too tough to squeeze. It worked into my hair really well and I've used the oil outside of the line and that's brilliant as well. So it works really well with other gels and products without causing any flakes. I'd say the oil is probably my favorite. The only negatives are mainly a double-edged sword. The fact that it's so natural means you have to be careful with how you store it. Keep it in a cool, dry place, otherwise it could spoil. Also, because it's so oily, it could weigh down very fine hair, but they do offer a moisturizing spray. If you have finer hair, that could be a great option for you. Also, the entire line is strongly lemony scented. So if you don't like lemon, you're not going to like this line. So once you're done, it should look something like this. So you'll have about six sections in the front and another five plaits at the back. But again, I could have done six. I just felt like being really lazy. And now I just tie my hair up for bed or sleep on a satin pillowcase. Once you take the plaits down in the morning, they'll look something like this. And I'm simply going to take those front sections and use a claw clip to pin them into place. You could also use hair bands or bobby pins. I'm not actually going to separate the braid out at all. I'm going to kind of keep it in that super defined, really thick and fluffy look. So 
so again I'm just taking those front sections and pinning them back so the front section is completely off of the face and if need be I will section a little bit but I'm not separating much at all. When it's done, it'll look something like this, and this is what it'll look like as well from the back. So really super defined, and I leave it like this because it'll kind of separate and fluff itself out over time. A really simple, casual look that I love to do just for running errands, and it keeps the hair out of my face. So kind of cute. And of course, I will leave all Afrocentrics details down in the description box so you can check out the rest of the product and the rest of the range. Thanks so much for watching, bye.